The United States now holds a world record for testing, and by a lot, we've conducted more than 5.4 million tests, more than any other country anywhere in the world. And we're actually growing it very rapidly. You probably heard those numbers just came out. After encouraging governors for several weeks to leverage unused testing capacity in their states, last week we provided contact information for specific labs where they could find additional testing and capacity. Within 48 hours, the number of tests performed across the country began to skyrocket. Early in April, the United States averaged approximately 150,000 tests per day. That's up very, very substantially from a couple of weeks before. And the 150,000 a day has gone to way over 200,000 tests per day since Wednesday. This includes a 122 percent testing increase in Michigan, 124 percent increase in Maryland, and many other locations are right in that vicinity. And some are a little bit higher than that. To provide further guidance and support to the states, today we're releasing our blueprint for state testing plans and rapid response programs. Together, we're accelerating testing for Americans at retail locations across the country, and especially in our African-American and Hispanic communities. We're going very, very strong in those communities. There are currently 73 retail sites, uh, testing sites, and 25 states uh, in, those er in those specific areas, and we're increasing it very substantially. A lot of, a lot of progress has been made for African-American testing, Hispanic-American testing, and Asian-American testing.